Welcome to the top 10 countdowns of the richest women in the world in 2021. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do and turn on the notification bell. Number 10. Iris Fontbona. Iris Fontbona is the widow of Andronico Luxic, a mining and beverage magnate who died of cancer in 2005. Fontbona and their three sons, Jean-Paul, Andronico, and Guillermo Luxic, inherited his enterprises. Fontbona and her children also own a majority stake in Cuenco, a Chilean conglomerate with interests in banking, beer, and manufacturing. Antofagasta's chairman is Jean-Paul Luxic, and Kenko's chairman is Andronico Luxic. Number 9. Gina Reinhardt. Gina Reinhardt is Australia's wealthiest citizen, having amassed her fortune through the mining of iron ore. Reinhardt, the daughter of iron ore explorer Lang Hancock, rebuilt her late father's financially troubled company, Hancock Prospecting. The Roy Hill Mining Project, which began shipments to Asia in 2015, accounts for the majority of her fortune. In 1992, Reinhardt was appointed executive chairman of Hancock Prospecting. Number 8. Suzanne Clatton. Suzanne Clatton owns 19.1% of BMW, while her brother, Stefan Quant, holds 23.6%. Johanna, their late mother, was the third wife of famed industrialist Herbert Quant, who steered BMW to luxury market dominance. Clatton, an MBA economist, was instrumental in transforming her grandfather's Altana AG into a world-class pharmaceutical, speciality chemical firm. Clatton is the sole owner and deputy chair of Altana, which has yearly revenues of more than $2.5 billion. Number 7. Yang Weiyan. Yang Weiyan owns 57% of the real estate developer Country Garden Holdings, a stake that her father, Young Kwok Kyung, transferred to her in 2007. Yang is the chairman of Bright Scholar Education Holdings, a Chinese educational firm that went public on the New York Stock Exchange in 2007. Yang's aunt, Yang Morong, owns a stake in Bright Scholar and was named to the Forbes China Rich List in 2017. Number 6. Jacqueline Mars. Jacqueline Mars controls around one-third of Mars, the world's largest candy maker, which her grandfather started. She worked for the company for nearly 20 years and was a member of the board of directors until 2016. She is a well-known philanthropist who serves on six boards, including the Smithsonian Institution and the National Archives. Number 5. Miriam Adelson. Miriam Adelson is the widow of Sheldon Adelson, the former CEO and chairman of Las Vegas Sands, who died in January 2021 at the age of 87. She currently owns more than half of the $48 billion gaming business, which operates casinos in Las Vegas, Singapore, and Macau. She was born in Israel and went on to become a medical doctor specializing in addiction. She and Sheldon established the Sheldon G. Adelson Research Clinic in Las Vegas, which helps persons suffering from opioid use disorder. Number 4. Julia Koch. Julia Koch and her three children acquired a 42% share in Koch Industries from her late husband, David, who died in August 2019 at the age of 79. Koch, who was born in Iowa, traveled to New York City in the 1980s to work as an assistant to fashion designer Adolfo. She worked with many of his high-profile clientele, including Nancy Reagan, the First Lady. Julia met David on a blind date in 1991, six months later, they stumbled into one other again, began dating, and married in 1996. She gave $10 million to Mount Sinai Medical Center and $10 million to Stanford Children's Hospital to explore food allergies with her late husband. Number 3. Mackenzie Scott. Mackenzie Scott is an author and the ex-wife of Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos, whom she married for 25 years. They divorced in the middle of 2019. As part of the divorce settlement, Bezos transferred to Scott 25% of his Amazon stake, which amounted to 4% of the company. She signed the giving pledge in May 2019, shortly after announcing the terms of her divorce on Twitter. Scott announced over $6 billion in contributions to 500 NGOs in 2020 and another $2.7 billion to 286 organizations in June 2021. Number 2. Alice Walton. Alice Walton is Walmart founder Sam Walton's only daughter. 
Rather than working at Walmart like her brothers, Rob and Jim, she has focused on curating art. In January 2020, she announced plans to construct a holistic health institute in Bentonville, Arkansas, in response to America's broken healthcare system. She is the second richest woman in 2021 with a net worth of $61.8 billion. Number 1. Francoise Betancourt Myers. Francoise Betancourt Myers is the world's richest woman and the granddaughter of L'Oreal's founder. Betancourt Myers and her family own around 33% of L'Oreal stock. She has been on the board of L'Oreal since 1997 and is the chairwoman of the family holding business. When her mother Liliane Betancourt, the world's richest woman at the time, died at the age of 94, she became France's reigning L'Oreal heiress. Thank you for watching. For more informative videos like this please subscribe and turn on the notification bell.